Oh, yeah, y'all know that's my jam right there. Come on. Come on. I know people are saying don't ever do that again, Jimmy. Never do that again. It was my choice. Just like this series, choosing your own adventure. Choosing your own adventure. Man, I remember being a kid reading these Choose Your Own Adventure books. And you would read this riveting tale of, of this epic adventure. And, and you get to choose. Turn to page 162 to dive in that fiery lake. Grab that magical item to go and save the kingdom. Or turn to page 12 to rescue the princess from that ogre. Or turn to page 19 to let the princess die. It's your adventure. It's your choice. You got to choose. And that's what made it so awesome. And that's what we're going to be about for these next four weeks. We're going to be talking about how we get to choose our own adventure. Now listen, whether it's a journey to Mordor, the upside down, outer space, or really wherever Forky ran off to this time, we all love a great adventure story. Maybe that's because deep down we know that we are designed to live an adventure story of our own. And... With Jesus, we can. Listen, there is no greater adventure story ever than knowing God more deeply. So for the next four weeks, four weeks, we're going to be talking about ways we could do that. We're going to be talking about how we could do that by spending time with God, by spending time with others, by sharing our stories and using our gifts to serve others. Y'all, I'm going to be asking you to step out of your comfort zone. I'm going to be asking you to be bold. I'm going to be asking you to do some awesome stuff, but nothing as crazy. First, you got to do the truffle shuffle. Come on! <laughs> as the truffle shuffle. Y'all know that was hilarious. The Goonies, one of my all-time favorite movies. Get this, guys. We're going to have four big ideas for the upcoming week. Four of them. Here's the first one. Knowing God is an adventure, not a formula. Guys, it's not 1 plus 1 equals 2. A plus B equals C. The square root of something is nothing. I have no idea. I hate math. It's an adventure. God is an adventure. The second one is relationships are a choice. They're not an accident. We choose the relationships that we get into, whether they're good, they're bad, they're ugly, or indifferent. We choose them. None of them are by accident, and God has placed us there for a reason. The next one is your story is still in progress, not completed. Y'all, your story is still going. Your story is still going. You are still having an adventure. You are still choosing it. Let's go. Let's go. And the last one. You could change the world today, not tomorrow. You guys are the church of now, not the church of tomorrow. You are rock stars. I believe in you. Go out and get it. You know, get it. I have all the faith in you. I believe in you. I am behind you. Your other leaders, they are behind you. We love you. We know that you guys got this. Now listen, show up at 9.30 in the morning. You can bring your own breakfast like I'm this. I'm just going to grab a healthy breakfast. Are those gummy bears wrapped in a fruit roll-up? Breakfast burrito, but... Y'all know that was healthy. That was some yummy, yummy, yummy stuff right there. Or, if you don't want your own healthy breakfast, eat the burritos. Not. Eat the donuts we got for you. Now listen, I love you guys. You guys are unbelievable. Unbelievable. I want nothing more than to see you this Sunday as we start this series. Peace!